I, no, I just just give him a few pointers, you know, how to turn you on and such like. What? By suggesting that my dead mother is retarded <laughs> and then masturbating himself through his clothes. <laughs> If I may just interject. Well, you're even worse! Don't you know how to control him? Of course I do. I masturbate him through his clothes. <laughs> Look, as a PCSO, I can handle this. <clears throat> now, let's all take a deep breath. Close your eyes. Now, try to visualize your anger as a big white ball of light. <laughs> That's amazing! Yeah, yeah. Vanish in at the first sign of trouble. That's just like the real police. <laughs> so I don't need you to interfere with my life and I don't need a boyfriend. It's just I see you sat in that drafty old flat like some sad old lesbian. <laughs> Naked. Then <laughs> another lesbian turns up. <laughs> and then asks if she can fix your boiler and then water goes everywhere and you start playing with each other. <laughs> Okay, I know that you're only doing this because you care and because you feel guilty about, you know... I really do. I hated the way it ended. Yes, well, so do I. But, you know, I'm fine on my own. So you're not lonely? Of course I'm bloody lonely. But, you know, sending over ex-boyfriends and piss-heads, it's just, it's, it's condescending. It means talking down to. <laughs> well, like chatting to a toddler. <laughs> It very much is. So you'll be fine? Absolutely. Oh, come here then. Come on. Oh. Oh, hey. <laughs> Hepatitis C. <laughs> Piers Morgan. So, Mrs Keogh, tell me why you think you'd make good PCSO material. <clears throat> I look good in a narrow sweater, um, I love the gaze, <laughs> and I can walk in time to the music from the bill. <laughs> right. Sorry, do you actually have any idea as to what being a PCSO involves? Uh, of course I do. We patrol, we give it the old elu elu elu, <laughs> and we beat the crap out of people. <laughs> Mrs Keogh, let me level with you. This role requires someone with a little more... Muscle. ...sanity. <laughs> God, I've messed this up, haven't I? <laughs> Nothing wrong with your observational skills, then. <laughs> OK, listen. I got mugged. I was with my baby. He took my phone, my wallet. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, well, the rest of your lot weren't. I just think if I can stop this from happening just by walking up and down in a silly hat, <laughs> I just don't want my baby or anyone else's baby to grow up in a world where they have to watch their mum getting mugged. I see. And I don't care what I have to do. Even if I can't kick, punch or fire anything. <laughs> Can I kick, punch or fire anything? No. <laughs> well, I'll do the job anyway. Because I want the world to be a safer place for my family. <sighs> Could you explain this brutality thing? Because that's something I might be interested in pursuing. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the bitch is back. Zip it, Claypole. I'm not in the mood. Let me guess. Still no baby daddy for little Louise. I interviewed everyone. Even that bloke who hangs around the bushes buttering his knob. <laughs> I interviewed Gaz and he was too laddy. I interviewed you and you were just a big old ball of flaming gayness. None taken. I'll never find anyone good enough for little Louise. Oh, boo-hoo. You'll manage. Just get on with it. I won't. I can't get her to sleep. I can't change nappies. I I'm even rubbish at breastfeeding. Louise, how can you be rubbish at breastfeeding? Because I keep forgetting which one's skimmed and which one's semi. <laughs> well, hooking up with some random bloke isn't going to sort it all out. I just need help. No, you don't. You need support. And you know what? Here, right here, You've got something way more important than a man. <gasps> Gin. <laughs> Friends. Oh, right. Hmm. Cheers, Tim. Oh, don't mention it. I'm always here. For both of you. Look, I just need to powder my nose and I, I think she needs changing. 
Do you mind? <laughs> You're being serious. I've just manicured. Who was next, please? Oh, my God. I'm all alone. I'm going to have to be self-reliant. <gasps> I'm a pleb. And I just think that the time has come for you on your own two feet. Clean yourself up. And most importantly, get the hell out of my flat! Oh, bonjour! Yes, exactly. Uh, Desmond Zacker. Yes, go talk, big guy. Oh, you. Oh, sorry, you entertaining? No, he's just leaving, aren't you, Barry? As, uh, uh, <laughs> ah, sorry, I suppose we can't get away with it forever. <laughs> Little bastard! Do you know you what trumps today? They take the piss! Oh, well, I know, they do leave the smell of it behind. No, that's me. I've just been to Janet's. <laughs> Look, Donna, I've come to apologise. Oh, what's Gaz told you to do this time? Bring me a bottle of Lambrini and a copy of Chat magazine? It's about me moving back to London. Oh, for God's sakes, for the last time, I'm not coming. Why should I? Donna, I don't want you to come and live with me. <laughs> I want to come and live with you. What? You're right. It's time someone did something special for you. So for you, I'm moving to Runcorn. Well, what about your job? Well, I'll think of something. My old man's a... A dustman? <laughs> no, I was going to say market store holder. Oh. And I've got the gift of the gab. Get your pears! <laughs> <laughs> that, that's quite amazing. I know. I'm going to get a stall, and I'm going to get the Runcorn website as my iPhone homepage. Well, welcome to the matted hair around the arsehole of the universe. Thanks, <laughs> But if I move in with you, there's something I want you to do for me. Yeah, anything. I want you to divorce Gaz. Okay, um... Yeah, okay, I will. Oh, okay, here he goes. Uh, Gaz, Gaz, can I have a word? Hang on, hang on, what? You're back together? Yeah. I don't know if I made up for you. Hmm. Gaz, I want a divorce. What? And I want a quick one. Make your mind up. <laughs> a quick divorce, Gaz. I don't want to be Mrs Wilkinson anymore. That's fine. Yeah, that's great. It's lovely. I love a divorce. Oh. Well, thanks, Gaz. Hey, go on. Yeah. Gaz, love, you're as white as a sheet. You look like you've just seen a ghost. I feel like I just have. Hello, 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 hello. Gaz, will you teach me the ways of this town? I just want to fit in. Step, step, shimmy. Hello, hello, hello. That is totally lesbian chic. <laughs> Uh, divorce papers have just come through, you know, it's really happening, so... Oh. Hey, Mr. Bartender, give me a drink. I want a cold, wet glass with bubbles in it. More comedy on the way here on BBC Three, and there's some bad news about Banana Man. Plus, there's a new Western in the making. It's Horn and Corden next on BBC Three. Waga, waga, please!